Well, what did the doctor say? Worse? But nobody told me. <laughs> well, you know I couldn't be there. No, I told you. Look, I'll be on the train in 20 minutes. Magic is for real, don't you think? Sure. What if I told you that I have a magic map? One that holds an ancient spell. We'll make a deal. Okay, that's it. Look, today has been one of the worst days in a long time. Just. Leave me alone or I'll call security. Touch the map. If after touching the map you still don't believe, I'll vanish and, and stop bothering. Oh, once, once, just tap once. Okay, I tap once, then you leave. Sure. So? Who are you? Will Wisp, nice to meet you. Uh, no, no, I mean, what are you? Well, some people think I'm a leprechaun. Others might uh, consider me to be an ignis fatuous. But personally, I like to think of myself as a, a, one of the last guardians of magic. Has a nice ring to it, don't you think? This doesn't make any sense. So you still don't believe, eh? Well... Why don't you try again? No way. You, you weren't kidding. This, this thing, this, this map, it really is magic. Of course, I told you. <laughs> well, I didn't believe you. But I used to. You used to what? To believe. When I was little, I loved fairy tales. Peralt, Anderson, Grimm all became Dickens, Fitzgerald, and Wilde as I grew older. I loved stories so much, I thought I needed to share some of my own. And my stories weren't bad, but the words just didn't flow from me as they did those writers. And the more I grew up, the more the stories became pointless and empty. I guess I forgot how magic felt. Sorry if I offended you earlier. I had a rough day. No offense taken. May I? Uh, don't you have a train to catch? There's another one in 20 minutes. Besides, there are a lot of places on here I haven't seen yet. Is this how it feels to really be alive? Ground beneath my heels, slowing down the time. How do I let go of all that weighs me down? Then I see the
No! What? The gate of destiny is forbidden. Forbidden? It's a dangerous threshold. Once you cross it, there's no way of knowing where you'll emerge. I'm sorry, I didn't even think you'd notice it. Well, what's there? Nobody knows for sure. What if I wanted to cross it? There were rules. You couldn't. Not unless you sacrifice your most beloved possession in exchange. It's your call, but I wouldn't recommend it because there could be no way back. You are very quiet. I was just thinking, uh, remembering. Your mother's necklace. Yeah, it was my grandmother's. She gave it to my mother for her birthday. But it broke. And fixing it was too expensive, so she resigned herself and put it away. And then I remember one day, it was my birthday, and she told me to go to the jewelry store, this store right here and she'd arranged to have it fixed for me. It's still the best gift I've ever received. I can be right. The clock is ticking and the meter is running, my young friend. Will I see you again after I leave? Well, who knows, uh, but it's very unlikely. Then I need a favor. I'm gonna make a decision about that gate before I leave, and I need to talk to someone. Will you help me? Look, you asked me to do something earlier and it took some convincing, but I did it. Now it's me who's asking you for help. Who do you want to speak to? Are you sure this is the right room? Of course. My mother, she's sick. There is no one here. I don't know. What happened? Well, where is she? Where? Wh what? No. No, you should have told me. You knew. You knew! I'm sorry. Tell me, why are you here? You wouldn't be if you didn't know what was gonna happen. I didn't. You're lying. No, I am not. Bullshit! Look, I don't control this map as much as the map controls me. I'm getting tired of your games. Games? There are no games. From the very beginning, it was the map, it was it that was searching for you. More bullshit. It wanted to take you to the past where your memories live so that you could be reminded of how magic felt when you needed it most. You're, you're lying. You're here for a reason. Can we bring her back with the gate? No. The gate of destiny cannot bring back the dead. It doesn't work that way. Then why are you here? I told you to help you, but maybe not in the way that you would wish. I'm sorry. I thought you left.
changed my mind. I gave up on magic once. I'm not giving up again. <laughs> you don't understand. Uh, when I stopped writing, my mother, she said to me, Hope, don't give up on magic. That's the way she said it. And I ignored her and I stopped believing in me. I stopped believing in things bigger than me, things worth fighting for. And the map, it helped me to believe again. And now I'm not gonna stop, if not for me, for her. I wanna see what's beyond that gate. Take good care of it. It's been a long day. Getting here was difficult. Why don't you go home, Hope? I'm not leaving go, you, Mom. Go get some rest. I want to be here with you. I'll be here tomorrow. I want to be here with you today. Then, then tell me one of those stories that you used to write. Don't remember sure, any. Sure you do. Sure you do. Okay. Once upon a time, there was a map. A magic map. That not only allowed people to travel through space, but through time. But time travel is more than complex and very difficult, so the map needed a guardian. 